Hey everybody, this is Sean, and this is the Samsung Gear 360. It's a camera that shoots, what else? 360 degree photos and video. Now, we had heard that Samsung might be bringing something like this to MWC, but I wasn't expecting it to be something this small and this consumer friendly. It's obviously working with a two lens system, which is becoming more and more popular with these 360 degree cameras. Each one has an f2.0 lens on it, and it shoots a 195 degree field of view. So the image from one side and the other side actually overlap. Uh, that's important when you're stitching those photos and videos together. It makes the quality a little bit better and it means that each side can be a little bit higher resolution. Now this camera is gonna be able to shoot the equivalent of a 30 megapixel still and 3840 by 1920 video. So that's a little bit sub UHD, but it's still gonna be good enough for even seeing it on uh, Gear VR. And we've tried it out here and the quality looks pretty good. The stitching looks pretty decent. And for consumer level 360 degree cameras, it looks like Samsung's got something that's going to enter the market at a pretty competitive place. Now what we do know is that it works with the Galaxy S7 to stitch all the footage and photos together. You're gonna shoot on the camera and then download the footage wirelessly to your phone and use the processor there to stitch everything together. From there you can share it to Facebook, YouTube, or any other platform that's been supporting native 360 video. Now Samsung says this is gonna be released a little later this year, probably in Q2, but we don't know exactly how much it's gonna cost or how you're gonna be able to get it. Maybe it'll be bundled with an S7 or the Edge uh, or with a Gear VR. Uh, what we do know is that it's another entry into the market that's going to make shooting 360 photos and 360 videos a lot easier.